Good morning. It's early on Saturday morning. Try not to wake my husband up. Oh, he fell asleep downstairs. So anyway, I have these two things that I keep samples in. And a lot of times when I would trade, I would throw one of my samples in. So that's one of the reasons I kept them all and kept them in this can and this bin. <laughs> so these are things though that I want to try and these are samples and some of them I want to try. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to dump them all out on the bed <laughs> and then we'll go through these. Start with this. And these. Um, this is a lot of stuff. Like I haven't even, not even counted any of it. But there are things that right off the bat I can take out of this pile. Um, I know that I want to try this. This is a hand cream my daughter got from Ipsy. Um, and she just had tons. And so I always am on the hunt for good hand cream. Um, I like this shampoo quite a bit. Um, I'm going to hold on to these. I don't see any expiration date. Um, my daughter bought this. I know it's not, uh, she did, wasn't good for her. It's a Clarisonic cleanser. Wasn't good for her, but, um, I'm going to use it. It exists in the space-time continuum of my house. Um, and therefore, even though it's not cruelty-free, I feel like I can use it. Um, then there's this Briogeo Blow Dry Perfection Heat Protectant Cream. And I like the Briogeo project products. I think I might actually give this away. Yeah, I think I'll, I'll declutter that because I don't blow my hair dry. Um, then I have these two Strivectin. I will never part with these. These are bi-weekly use, um, retexturizing scrub. So it must have like chemical exfoliant too. Um, this is something I really like, and it's a texture spray by um, High Performance Hair Care. It's sugar texturizing spray. I have another one. I really like it. Okay, these are Erno Laszlo soaps. I keep these. I don't know why. Um, this is an Erno Laszlo. It says light controlling lotion, so I'm not really sure whether that's um, for real oily skin or not. Um, this lipstick escaped my lipstick purge. Um, and even though I really like the color, I'm going to give that away. I never used it. Um, I, I did test a little bit on the back of my hand. Then there's this real chemistry and, uh, cleanser. So I guess it has something in it. It says, um, foaming cleanser. So yeah, I think maybe I'll start using that. Well, I'll put it in here for now. Uh, this is just a little thing of Estee Lauder Enlighten. I'll hold on to that. Um, this is a Hava Supercharged Minerals. I didn't like this when I used, I had a little bottle of it. I didn't like it at all. Um, so I'm going to declutter that. Okay, anything Dermalogica I'm going to hold on to. Um, one is Charcoal Rescue Mask and one is Special Cleansing Gel. I love the Special Cleansing Gel, but it's super expensive. So, I don't plan to spend that. Um, I have, let's see, what have I got here? Um, Dr. Brandt Pore Thing. It's an um, T-Zone Pore Tightener. I think I will give these away. So these will be decluttered. Okay, Kate Somerville. I almost bought the moisturizer in. Um, it was offered in the add-ons for FabFitFun. By the way, down below you can subscribe uh, getting $10 uh, off your first box using my link. But anyway, I almost got it and I just, I really should have. But anyway, I'm going to keep both of these. They're 0 0.07 
ounces and I think they're good for more than one use. They even have like a little bottle thing here. Um, so I think I'm going to hold on to those. I should use them pretty soon, however. Uh, this is Clinique Moisturizer. I, you know what, I don't even think this is good anymore. I'm going to toss this. Um, this is Borlay Moisturizer. I used to love this. I'm going to toss it. This I'm going to hold on to, and you'll be surprised. One of them is an in-shower facial, and the other is overnight hydrating um, facial. Now, the reason that I'm keeping these is because CVS makes a clone of these, and rather than buy a full-size um, CVS clone and find out I don't like it, I'm going to try these. If I like it, then I can buy the um, clone from CVS. Okay, and this Josie Marin, I believe is cruelty free. Um, I'm going to hold on to this because it's got all these samples of foundation and I think my daughter and I would probably enjoy trying these out. I, she would probably be that color. I would probably be like that color. So anyway, um, I think that'll be fun to try out. Um, this is, oh, this is a double wear thing. I already know what my color is. I just can't get it. That's all. <laughs> um, unless they go cruelty free, which they don't appear to be going that direction. So this is not something I would even bother to pass on. So I'm just going to toss that. Um, this is a sample of the Tatcha water cream. I would like to try that. Um, this is Oribe shampoo and conditioner. I like Oribe, so I'm going to keep that. Um, this is the Hask, and I use a spray from them, um, which is really nice. But anyway, this is shampoo and conditioner. I'll hold on to that. Oh, I got all these Nivea things. Um... Well, I guess these are the only two Nivea things. So, cocoa butter lotion and dry to very dry skin extend, extended moisturizer. I'm going to keep these and I'll tell you why. CVS makes a clone of the Nivea products as well. So, if I like these, I will buy the clone. Um, because Nivea is not cruelty free. Um, actually should also hold on to this. Maybe maybe they might have a clone for the uh, Olay. They have a clone for just about everything. Um, this is Giorgio Armani Fluid Sheer. It's, I believe it's a foundation. But I don't know what color it is. Um, I'm just going to toss that. Not cruelty free anyway. Hourglass Illusion. Um, I'm going to hold on to that. Um, anything from Burt's Bees. I like to try. Let's see. Um, BB Cream. I'll try that. Um, this Olay. I'll try that because there might be a clone at CVS. By the way, CVS is cruelty free. Um, soy Fresh cleanser all skin types I think I will give that away um, this is glam glow mud to foam I'll give that give that away um, this is by Terry I've had this particular sample knocking around forever that's gonna go in the trash I love this cleanser this is something that my daughter got it on um, uh, Birchbox and she tried mine and she didn't really like it and I love it. Um, you can buy this on the Birchbox shop. So anyway, I, I'm going to hold on to that. I really like it. Oh, what can I say about Visanti Brighten Up? There's just nothing better. <laughs> um, this is Karen Herzog Vitamin Something or Another. I think there are two of these things. Yeah, Vitamin A... I'm going to throw these out. I don't know how old they are. Um, these two Dermalogica things I'm going to keep. Biolage 
fortifying cream. Uh, I am going to give that away. Biolage isn't cruelty free. Um, okay, this is coconut oil from Palmer's and they are cruelty free as far as I know. So I'm going to try that. This is Bioderma Cleanser. I'm going to give that away. Okay. This is Dream Skin by Dior. I'll give that away or throw it out. Yves Saint Laurent Forever Light CC Primer. Um, I'm going to, by the way, just FYI, I'll check all the expiration dates on everything before I give them away. Um, so I assume a lot of these, since I do see expiration dates, um, that they're probably uh, ready to go. All right, this is plant-based nail polish remover. I did not like this and it does not work. So I'm gonna just toss it out. Um, my neighbor does nail, so I know she's got stuff that she already likes. Okay, so this is shampoo and conditioner by OGX, which is not a cruelty-free brand, but they do carry this at CVS and I will try it. And if I like it, I will buy the clone. Biotherma, Biotherma Hum Cleanser, Toner, Moisturizer. I'm gonna let that go. Um, Dr. Roebuck's Pure Hydration Rich Hydrating Hypoallergenic Face Cream. That might be worth trying. Um, this is Comforting Cleansing Milk by Nux. I like Nux. Nux, however you say it. Um, however, this, there is no cruelty-free substitute, I will give that away. Um, Hadalabo Deep Multi-Layer Hydration, I'm getting rid of that. That's not cruelty-free, and I don't think there's a clone. Marcel Skin Perfector Complete Daily Corrector. I like Marcel stuff, so I'm going to hold on to that. Oh, Kate Somerville, anti-aging sensitive skin. Um, definitely holding on to that. Living Proof Perfect Day, five in one styling treatment. I will hold on to that. Hourglass Solution Hyaluronic Skin Tint. I will hold on to that. What color is it in? Ivory, okay. Um, Stay Matte by Rimmel, lightweight liquid mousse foundation with all day shine control. I'm going to get rid of that. Okay, this is Palmer's again. Free sample coconut facial moisturizer. I will try that. They carry Palmer's at my drugstore. Um, Uli Henriksen. I love everything from Uli Henriksen. Okay, I do not need more of this. Um... I think they might have a clone, but I don't know if that's good enough reason to keep that. Fructis, ay ay ay. Um, one minute hair mask, get rid of that. This is from Replenix, I love Replenix. This is a retinol, I'll keep that. Derma Doctor Wrinkle Revenge Ultimate Hyaluronic Serum. I will try this. Yeah, I'll try that. And I'll hold on. No, I won't hold on to that because I already held on to one. So I'll get rid of those two Olays, three Olays. Oh, gosh. Um, like um, Divine Cream, getting rid of that. They mistreated one of my favorite YouTubers. Um, and they're not cruelty free. They are not cruelty free. How many people can say that before they sink in? Hello, you're not cruelty free. Anyway, um, Power Lift Advanced Ultra Rich Moisturizer Hydropeptide, I think might be cruelty free. I'm going to hold on to this and look it up. Um, we dad. Now, I think this is, um, I think this stuff is cruelty free. I like, I've used um, Ooey Dead products before um, and I, they carry it in my salon, so I'm gonna hold that. Oh, Perio Sciences. I definitely need to hold on to this and 
oh, it fell off of here. Um, it's supposed to be good for your gums, and I just, but I can't use it yet because I just went to my dentist, so I'm going to try it. Oh, that's nail polish. I'm going to try it, and if I like it, I'm going to buy it from Derm Store. It's, it's really good for your gums, um, so I'm going to hold on to that. I have two of these. This stuff's not cruelty free. I'm getting rid of that. Um, this is going to be garbage. This is L'Oreal lip paint. Let's see what else I have. Oh, this stuff is great. Hiker's Foot Healer. <laughs> Duh. I am going to buy this. This stuff is awesome. Um, so I don't get rid of the samples until I buy it. Immaculate from Hourglass. I'll hold on to that. Ah. I just got rid of a bunch of Exuvian stuff. This is step two in a bunch of stuff you do together. <laughs> so I'm going to get rid of that. That's going to be garbage now. Um, Clinique Smart Night. Going to throw that out. Fresh Black Tea Aged Delay Cream. I'll let the neighbor try that. Redken Diamond Oil. I already have um, a big bottle of this my daughter gave me. Yeah, I'll give it to my neighbor. I'm just was debating whether I should just toss it out. I'm gonna I'll look at uh, everything closely before I give it to my neighbor. Um, this earth sourced antioxidant enriched natural moisturizer from Paula's Choice. I do want to try that. This is from Agave Healing Oil. Wow. You can't, it's not a multi-use, so I guess you just have to put it on your hair and hope for the best. It's 4 mLs, which is, I'm going give to give that away. <laughs> I don't have damaged hair anymore because I no longer color my hair. Uh, La Roche-Posay Daily Dark Spot Correcting Moisturizer. I'm going to give that away. Uh, Vichy Idilla Life Serum. I'll give that away. Marcel Skin per Perfector. I'll hold on to that. I like Marcel. Um, and I think the last items might be holding on to. Oh, huh. Healthy Hoo Hoo, which is a wipe for your Hoo Hoo. Anyway, um, I'd be embarrassed to give that um, to anybody. So, um, Body Perfection Gel All in One Insta Sun by Perfect. Um, so I'm going to look this up, see if it's cruelty free. It, it is highly rated, so I'll check that out and see if I like it. Um, this is Uli Henriksen Foaming Milk Cleanser. I just finished one of these and I love it. Um, I will hold on to this. Of course, it won't be foaming in my, um, out of a pack, so. All right. And then there is Confidence in a Cream. Um, and I'm going to try this. The reason I have a post-it note on is because the plastic crap from the card it came on would not come off. So I have some stuff over here that I don't know that I reviewed or not. Um, I had two of these healthy hoo-hoos. So um, yeah, these are uh, purity made simple. I'm going to get rid of that. And Guerlain BB cream, I'll get rid of that. not bad. I feel pretty good about this. All right, so um, what I will do is I will count these up and I will whoop, um, check expiration dates and I'll be right back. Believe it or not, this is 41 items that I am decluttering. Now, I know samples seem kind of silly to declutter, but you know what? In this case, it's really not. My neighbor is very happy getting everything I've given her so far, and she will enjoy getting these as well, um, so she can try different products. So anyway, 41 declutters. Not too shabby. So, um, continuing to follow my declutter series. Today I just did these. Um, tomorrow I might break away and do some blush but I also might not get to it because uh, because I have a lot of um, work to do. 
Um, this is great, so I'm and I'm very happy because my samples were exploding and I just wanted to get rid of them. So anyway, thank you and stay tuned for more declutters. Thanks and have a beautiful evening. Good night.